Welcome back to Breath of Fire 4. Well, we have just finished events here on this abandoned island, or this abandoned ship, and discovered that uh, the thing causing the ruckus here was not, in fact, a, a ghoul or a ghost of some kind. It was rather a very confused giant rock monster. But we have since dealt with that there, so it's time to get back to the ship. Let's go. Oh, up here. And would you look at this, we've got a new monster, a Krabby. Okay, hello. Well, uh, yeah, let's see what we can do. Hmm, nice stuff. Okay, I think, I think we can take this crab thing, right? I have no idea how much HP it has. Oh, it's got a knockout. Can we learn that? That looks impressive. If, if we can learn knockout, I'd like to learn knockout. And look at it with that great big claw of it. Okay, I guess we're not learning knockout today. And a decent bit of XP. Wunderbar. And let's get going. Okay, so yeah, back to the ship. You want to go back to the ship? Yep. Let's get in. I hate this place anyway. Being around all these sunken ships gives me the creeps. Okay, and we are back on the open sea. Looks like the wind's picked up again. Day says... Anything that gets affected by the aura of the Endless, like that thing back on the islands, nothing but trouble. I wonder where the real sea dragon is. It's going to be hard finding him in all this ocean. Oh, it, it will be, Nina, but I've got a bit of an idea for that. Even a simple rock can gain sentience and move around like that if exposed to the aura of the Endless, endless long enough. Dace has been explaining to me how that happens. <laughs> All right, uh, the rest of our trip should be uneventful. At least, I hope it will be. So do we, Captain. So, what? He's not the captain, is he? No, presumably he's not the captain. All right, I think we have to... Come on, come on. Just go talk to the rest of our friends. rest of the crew. Sorry about that. We usually don't get mixed up like that, you know? Uh, they say we should get there in a couple of days. Yes, let's. Uh, and I think it's just, uh, just these two that we talk to. Maybe the monsters are attracted to us because of Ryu. Yeah, maybe. I mean, that, that is kind of what we said. Um, and, and here's just the hold, isn't it? Okay. I don't think we can talk to Silas, can we? No. Silas is chilling. Okay, then, so I guess what? Do we just, I suppose, rest? Okay, and it looks like we've made it. Alright. To be able to affect a monster like that, even though you're incomplete, you must be very powerful, Ryu. Says Dace. <laughs> well, I, I, I imagine so. Uh, what's Ustla gotta say? Looks like we'll be there soon. Yep, we will. Okay, let's uh, see if we can make port and explore this new area. Because we've been at sea for a while, and I'm sure we'd like to see something else. Wait, how do we... How do we get up there? Okay, it looks like we can't get up there. Um, hey guys. I can't believe how salty the sea air is. What I wouldn't give for a nice hot bath. Yeah. It looks like Hesperia is quite a ways away from Lip. We've got a long road ahead of us. We should see Lip anytime soon now. Oh, I love I love the tune. The music in this whole game has been pretty decent. Like that uh it's got like that eastern 
influence to it. Like, you know, like a sitter. Thank you for everything, Zig. It was nothing. Hang on, did we decide, decide to go with the Mr. T voice for him? Of course, you still got a long way to go. Much as we might want to. We can't help you get to Hesperia, you know? You've already helped us enough by letting us use your ship. Thanks again. No worries, huh? Let us know if you need to borrow our ship again, okay? Take care. Well, we will be needing to borrow it again. But uh, first, I just want to have a little gander around here. Talk to the merchants if we can. Uh, C blue sea, the fish and the manilo. Get to have Oh, okay, so this is the, the Manilos who trade stuffs for items. Um, and I think we determined that we don't have... Gyosil, you like fishing too. Fishing is a true man's sport, don't you think? I've been fishing all my life, all over the world. If you want, I can share some of my tricks with you. Interested? I mean, okay. What? You call yourself a fisherman? You're not ready for what I have to teach. Unless you've got at least 3,000 fishing points. I'll be staying here for a while. See you later. Okay, so, as you guys have guessed, he is a master, and the requirements for getting him to teach us are 3,000 fishing points. Now, I have been neglecting my fishing a bit, because I'm not the biggest of fans of it, but you do get some decent items, so I'll, I might have to see about doing a little bit of it off-screen, just to, you know, maybe just to see if we can farm some, some better items and whatnot. Because certainly in Breath of Fire 3, it was a brilliant way to, uh, to just get some... Well, just free items, and the items end up being like useful throughout the tenure of the whole game. Um, you say you say you came from all over the other way of the ocean? Well, there's not much to see, but I hope you like it here. Uh, you know, I don't know. We're still we're still seeing. Uh, let's see if we can head up here. No, anything but this Manila? Looking for something? Okay, we can buy some stuff here. Ooh. Look at that sword, piercing edge. Oh, baby, look at that weapon. Like, how are we not getting that? 147. Has the same effect as Weaken. And the battle rod for Nina? Once again, I'm not really... I'm not too, too concerned about getting weapons for Nina. Oh man, we could definitely get a decent upgrade here. The Robe of Wind. Uh, well, I, I, I say we do it. What do you think? Let's trade. So if we trade the Piercing Edge for the Claymore... Yeah, let's go. Oh yeah, I like that. Uh, do we get one for Sias as well? Hmm, he's gonna be useful, isn't he? So, yeah, why not? And we trade it for the Moon Sword. It's gonna equal 720 Zenny. Yes. Let's go. And then the Stolen Club for Cray. Instead of the Quarter Staff. Yep, let's do it. And do we want this here for Ursula? Long Barrel Gun. Fire Attack versus All. So at the moment she's got, what, the Scatter Shot? Well, her gun does do damage to All anyway. So... Hmm... I mean, yeah, go on, why not? We've got the money for it. We can do some farming if we have to. We can we can figure it out, can't we? Um, right, for Nina. Or for Ursula, do we want a robe of wind? Mm, certainly for Nina. I think that's going to be a decent help. Yeah, instead of, instead of the wetsuit. Okay. I'm, I'm happy with that. We've bought some good stuffs. We're in a good place. Let's carry on. Uh, this here is the village inn. Huh? You want to sleep? No worries. Uh, it's always warm here. You can sleep anywhere you like. Fifties. Uh, no, 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 thank you. Never, never mind. No, thank you. Are uh, you, sir? You want to get to the Western continent? Hmm. I've heard you can get across by walking across the tidal flats. Is that so? Well, we might have to look at that in a bit. Uh, let's talk to you guys. You know the little village to the south of here called Pop Pop? I've heard there's a fellow living there that came from the mainland. Okay, that could be useful. 
Most folks here don't bother go to go down to the mainland. Afraid you can't help you much. Sorry. Alright, well, I believe we will try and get down to the mainland, but not yet. First of all... Wait, what? Oh, we can jump here, can't we? Okay. Looking for some items? Are we looking for items? No, we're not. I'll, I'll get some twisters. Can't go wrong with a few twisters and a few poppers, right? For when I eventually do some fishing. Okay, but with you, I'd like to use the ship again. Alright, you're just gonna have to trust me on this. Okay, so we can move around here. We have to take into account the wind direction, charging the wind direction, and we have to manage our supplies at the bottom, and yeah, but basically we're exploring. So somewhere here is the wind dragon, and somewhere are also some items that we can find and uh, and discover through exploration. But we have to do that there by gauging where the wind direction is going to be blowing the ship. We can use the we can row or use our sails or set anchor, but we also only have a limited amount of supplies that we can use. So let's go. Let's see what we can do. Okay, so so the wind's blowing down first. So let's... Uh, no, we don't want to sail. Yeah, now we want to... Do we want to sail? I think we want to sail now. Oh yeah, nice big sail. Big happy sail. Okay, is this where we want to be? I think maybe this is where we want to be. Oh. Okay, let's keep it going. Uh, okay, somewhere around here. Is this it? Let's see. Oh, that doesn't look encouraging. Looks like there's nothing here. Yeah, I, I gathered that. I gathered that, my friend. Uh, okay, let's... It has to be around here somewhere. I think, is it these rocks? Let's see. Okay, come on. It has to be around here somewhere. I think it's here. Gotta be near here. Like it has to be around here, right? Let's. Uh, has to be around here, right? Oh, I like that sound. Here we go. Here we go. I am Haryong. From the depths of the eternal blue, I watcheth over this world. My domain toucheth every part of the land and surrounds it. I knoweth the name of any who dost have fin or scale. Tell me, young Yore Dragon, dost thou need us my strength? Uh, yes, please. Very well. Let us then stand witness to the fate of the world together. He's got some pretty cool armor, this, uh, this dragon. But I don't think he's the coolest of dragon form. I think, I think he's a jellyfish. I need to remember. Well, we'll, we'll see. Now we'll draw upon the Sea Dragon's power. Thank you. We learned Flood Tide. Alright, that is very cool. Now, there is some other stuff that we can explore and uh, look at. With a little bit of uh, fancy sailing. But, uh, is there something here? I don't think so. Anyhow, I, I don't have a problem just uh, heading back to base now, so let's go. Uh, okay, having done that, I think it is time for us to go check out the mainland. So let's do it. So from lip, we go down to the question mark.
And what are we gonna see here? Tar babies. Okay. Okay. And they hurt. God damn, they really, really hurt. But I feel like these new upgraded weapons have been worth it. Did we, wait, did we get the upgraded armor for Ursula? Hmm, I'm not sure. But... Yeah. Look, we might have to look at upgrading Ursula's armor when we get a chance. If we get a chance. Because I, I don't like her being so squishy. Um, anything here? No. Oh, hello. Tapuru, palu, palu. Poco, rikuku, paleka, paketo, tapu, palu, palu. Uh, it must be saying it's hurt, so let's give it some medicine. Um, what, what is it? It's hungry, so let's give it some food. It's in trouble, let's give it some money. It's just babbling. It's got to be food, right? Come on. You see a creature like this in the in the woods, you give it some food. I'm going to give it an apple. Here you go, buddy. Nah, peluku, peluku. Nah, mau, peluku, poto. What? It's probably saying, please give me more food. Um, okay. Let's give it, uh, let's give it, let's give it another apple. Nah, peluku, peluku. Now, Mao Peluco Poto. It's probably saying more food. Okay, well I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you a berry. Now, Peluco Peluco. Now, Mao Poto e na Peluco. It's probably saying, give me more food. Like it has to be right. Uh, let's go with another berry. Okay, yeah, you, th this is getting tiring. You, you know where this is going now, right? Got any more food? I'm guessing. So, okay, another apple this time, maybe? Oh, oh, mao! Tapo bonko pateko peluku! It must be saying, give me more. It's gotta be saying, that's enough, thanks, right? I'm sure this will be here forever. Now Santo Poco need Peluchi. Okay, yeah, we'll, we're, we're leaving, because we can't just stay here and feed you all day, buddy. Alright, we've got new enemies. Masks and Mirror. Okay, let's test out... I think we've seen all of the dragons so far, right? Let's test out Flood Tide. And just do your thing, guys. Oh, I, can I learn counter? I might be able to learn counter. Yeah, th this is the thing. Whenever you come across a new enemy, you come across a new enemy, you see him do cool abilities, and you think, I'd like to learn that. And then you wonder, can can my guy learn that? Yeah, this is a jellyfish, right? Oh, no. Okay. What on earth kind of sea creature is that? I gotta say, when I picture the sea god, like the sea dragon god, I don't imagine that. But I suppose this game is allowed to take liberties with the with the design of its monsters. Or of its dragons. All right, that's two of them. Ooh. Okay, that hurts a bit, but we'll be all right. Okay, attack, attack, and uh, let's try Rock Blast. There we go. XP here is nice. We get a buckler for that as well. I think we might definitely have to do a bit of um, leveling up here. 
Hang on, let's, uh, let's take a look. Can we get... Who would like the buckler? Maybe Ryu? Hang on, but we did say... That Ursula was looking a bit squishy, right? Can we give her some better stuff? No. Clearly no. Um... Okay, I guess... I guess it's gonna be Ryu then. There you go, buddy. And wait, what did he have before? We could give... Ah, it's not worth it. Not to lose speed. Yeah, the demons helped, didn't he? Mm. Now we're good. My guys are good. Let's just do a bit of healing, please, Nina. And... We should be good to go. Uh, okay, so we've got a fishing spot to the left. Let's go into the jungle. Let's see what is happening in this jungle. Alright, let's go try and stay on the the wooden things. The wooden planks. Because these things clearly affect our speed. Um, this way. Oh. And we have fire ants. Okay. Fire ant there and fire ant there. So I'm guessing... Can we assume then that, fi that fire will not do well against them? Can we assume that? We've got Flame Strike. Do we? We've got Flame Strike, haven't we? In Dragon form, so I don't think we can learn this one. Uses a shield to guard against normal attacks. Okay. What are you going to do against Rock Blast? Alright, nothing spectacular, it seems. Uh, let's go like so. Let's go... Rock Blast, let's go Nina. Some Cyclone, maybe? Oh, come on. I think we're going to have to start being careful now, because some of these enemies will... Like, clearly they hurt us. Right, here we go. I sense a combo. I sense a combo. Alright, that's one. Why didn't the combo work? I'm, I'm not sure. Let's see if we can get Nina to uh, use her abilities first. Then we'll get Ryu, normal attack, and Cray, normal attack. I think this is the way to play it, because Nina's the fastest, so this kind of guarantees that she goes first. There we are. There we are. Of course, lovely XP. I am loving it. The only unfortunate thing is I'm not loving how much healing we have to do after each engagement. But I suppose it can't be helped. Uh, up here. Come. Uh, this way. Where? Uh, okay. I guess it's taking us in this direction. Most curious. Alright, let's keep it going, guys. 
Let's keep it going. Uh, I mean, I have no idea where we're going. I'm just wandering around. All right, let's keep it going. Uh, so by the log bit. Um, okay, so how do we do this? Like this. Then, like so. Then, uh, like so, I think. Then, like so. Then, like so. And we get this. Toxic Claws. Is that gonna be for... For, um, Days? Uh, not Days, for Ershin. Oh, yes it is. Ranged attack poisons enemy. I will take it. Thank you. Yeah, we've been looking for a new weapon for him. So that is good. And now, carry on. Like so. Like so. And like so. Et voila. Now I know I've missed some items back there, but we can go back. And we've made our way to Pop Pop. Let's see what happens in Pop Bob. Oh my word. Temi, no! Topu, pull me! Cor, Perucci, Temi, no! What's all the noise about? Poco? Is that you? Just look at that jungle boy. Well, I'll be. Visitors. Please, please, come in. I see. So you're trying to get to the mainland, huh? I've kind of settled down now. Back in the day, I was quite the adventurer myself. I came here from the mainland several years ago. Then, of course, I met my wife. And I ended up staying here. I'm sorry, I haven't properly introduced myself. How rude. My name is Bade, and this is Sen. Shami, Rinpo, Poske, and Peso. They wanted to see you. We don't get many visitors here, you know. Like, what the hell? That's his wife? And this here is Poco, my wife. Pretty cute, isn't she? What the hell? I mean, Poco, Pewee! M maybe we shouldn't judge like that. Me, Wama Poto, Pewee! There's gotta be something wrong with this. She says your wife is also very beautiful. <laughs> um, anyway, can you tell us how we can get to the mainland from here? Oh, that's right, I'm sorry. So that's the way we wanna go, huh? Well, the people who told you that came from there... The people who told you that you can get there from here by crossing the flats were right. You can. That's what we want, right? However, you can only do so when the tide changes and exposes the road to the flats. You have to time it just right before the road disappears. Well, when is that? Peruchi, Soro, Suru, Ko. Tan kulu poko kairi ni. She says you should stay here for a while. She'll, th she'll tell you when the time comes and take you there. I mean, okay. Anything here? Yeah, okay, I suppose we can stay here, right? The pop up seems to know when it's possible to cross the flats. I don't know how, but they do. Don't worry, when the time comes, they'll take you. Um, okay. Okay, she says she doesn't know exactly when, when it will be, so you should relax and enjoy yourselves while you wait. Well, I mean, I'd like to, but like we won't even be able to understand these guys. Isn't it going to be a bit weird? Oh, what's up with this one? Huh? Looks like he, she isn't feeling very well. Should we give Tamara to... Puck Pookie. Uh, okay, can we give it a medicine, maybe? Would that help? 
there's a save thing here. Uh, it looks like these are Bade's notes on the Pop Pop language. Look at A to N. Ein, during a period, Ishi East, Kairu guide teach, Ko hear this, Michu secret, na fish. Ni, you that, no wrong bad. Okay. Uh, Nosta no, pop up us, Pegoto but still. Poto more amazing, Peruchi friend. Puka puka, slowly relaxed, also has connotation of what will be will be. Rikuku medicine, Roy rock stone. Okay, that's fascinating. Uh, Sanami south, Santo thanks, Sono sorry. Tan time, Tatoro dance, Temi enemy bad person. Treja, treasure. Okay, easy. Where she west. That's fascinating. They've got this whole. Uh, tur -tur okay, so were you guys paying attention to the language? Do you guys know what they said? Uh, isn't feeling very well. Well, yeah, that doesn't help, does it? Okay, well, yeah, if you guys, um, decided to use that little dictionary to, uh, figure out what's wrong with the. What? Someone's sick. Yes, in that room over there. One of the pop pops was crouched over the and moaning. The truth is, none of the herbs around here can be used to cure that disease. I've tried everything, but... Then, what's going to happen to him? Besides the pop pop, say, Puka Puka. What will be, will be. It's their way of life. Dying doesn't seem to bother them much. Well, it bothers me. We can't just let him die. We'll go get the herbs you need. Where can we find them? We can't just sit around here waiting, doing nothing. Let us do something to help pay back your hospitality. I mean, that seems reasonable. All right, then. First, you'll need to go to Lip. The herbs we need can be found somewhere in the ocean. Someone in Lip should be able to tell you where to find it. Okay. So what herbs do you need? Uh, something about the herbs in Lip. Thank you for your help. Okay, well, yeah, let's, um, we'll be heading back to Lip then, huh? Oh. Hey, hey little buddy. Peruchi Pukaka. Um, what's this one gonna say? Sona Pamiti Teruti Temi. Okay, I get you, buddy, but what does it mean? Yeah, okay, let's uh, let's head back to Lip. So, I mean, that was quite interesting. But I hope we can... Hope things will be a little bit more educational here. Uh, you want to get Western Continent? No. Uh, what about this Manolo? Uh, no. What about you? I saw a huge monster out in the ocean. It was like a giant snake. Really, I did. But no one believes me. Do you believe me? Yes. Uh, it was that place north of west of Shik. Where it gets really shallow and all the rocks are. There was this big face coming out of the water. It looked right at me. Okay, wonder what that could be. Is that worth going to investigate? One of the pop-ups is sick. That's a problem then, isn't it? I mean, they probably don't have much in the way of medicine, do they? No, I'm guessing they don't. So what can we do about it? There's a sick pop-up? Well, if you had some mozweed, maybe we could help them. Okay, that would help. Anything else? Or just mozweed? Uh, let's talk to you. Oh no, you're just the Manila, aren't you? Uh, would you know anything about how to help the pop-up? Huh, a medicine you can find at sea? I heard about something like that on the Nameless Island. To the east of here. It was called Mosweed or something like that. Okay, yeah, so it seems like very much that that's what we're going to be needing to find. Mosweed, which means... We'll probably have to get back on that ship again. Let's see. Uh, we're not looking for anything, never mind. Okay, well, let's um, prep for it then, guys, and then consider going to find this uh, Mosweed. Um, yeah, but anyway, we'll take a quick break here. When we get back, we will be venturing out, trying to find some mozweed, and seeing if we can help these 
poor, helpless, defensive little pop pubs. You know, because uh, if we can help, then we're going to try and help. And it's better than doing nothing. I mean, come on. But anyhow, that is all for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care.